All right, so first we're gonna start off with um, a concealer. I'm gonna use that as a um, as a base, and I'm going to set that with a eyeshadow, which is that color right there. Now I'm gonna be using the next the wet I'm sorry the Wet and Wild uh, palette. This is the um, palette that I'm gonna be using to create this look. I'm gonna start off with this little goldish like brownish color, and I'm gonna use that as my transition color, as a transition color, and you're just gonna blend back and forth until you want um, until you achieve the look the color that you want. That you're satisfied with now I'm gonna go in with the burgundy and I'm gonna set I'm gonna apply that right under the transition color and I'm just gonna blend that back and forth it's all about blending that's the technique And now I'm going to um, go back on top to my transition color and I'm going to add a little bit more just to blend out any harsh um, lines. Now I'm going to be using, it's like a darkish brown and I'm going to put that on my uh, crease. And we're just going to be blending away, blending our life away. And I'm going to use like a sherry champagne color and I'm going to set that on um, my lid just to give it a little pop. I'm going back in the other eyes to make it pop more. And I'm going back in with the same thing I just did. I repeated the same thing over again. Um, the transition, the burgundy color and the crease cut color. Now I am putting mascara on, the Smashbox X rated, and now I'm going to be using these uh, lashes that I bought from Dollar General, and they're only $2, and they're Starlet, and they're really amazing and thin. Look at the uh, thin line. I love them. They're not uncomfortable at all. With the glue. We're gonna use the Too Faced Hangover Primer. I forgot to mention that I did my eyebrows with this Ulta um, Duo and the Eyeliner. And there's a black side and a brown side and I used the brown. So yeah, you guys, I'm gonna be putting on the Better Stay made from Maybelline. And I haven't worn foundation in months. So it's gonna be, I'm gonna feel weird. Since it's so hot in Florida, I don't wear foundation at all. I wear, I just wear concealer to top these dark circles that y'all can see these dark circles. That's all I wear. So today's the day I'm gonna wear foundation. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna set that with the earth bun. Just to set my foundation, not too much, just a little. And I am going to have a tutorial on um, my hair when I'm done the makeup. So that will be um, two videos I'm doing today. So if you want to be interested and see how my hair turns out, stay tuned. Now I'm going to be using the Better Stay Concealer. Whoa. and I'm gonna blend away and usually people put it right here right here right here I put so much here that I can blend and also get that too you'll see you guys okay now that I blend that out away we're gonna bake
This is just to make my concealer, um, my contour pop more. I'm going to be using the my favorite palette of all time, the Perfusion. And you guys, I got this at uh, um, Burlington for $6. Y'all should pick it up. I heard it's the dupe for... Um, I heard it's the dupe for the Kat Von D. So, y'all want it? Y'all better go get it. I don't want to do it too dark. Okay, I just brushed everything off, all the baking, and now I'm using this palette. You already know I use it a lot. I'm going to use in this bronzer. The hula and all I'm doing is blending it towards upwards. And you, it looks dark and harsh, so I always go back in with the kabuki brush. That's the kabuki brush. And I... You see that? I blend it up. I squeeze it and I blend it up. And it don't look so harsh and crazy. You'll see. So I usually blend it up. With the... Alright, now I'm going to be blending it. You see how dark it is? All you have to do is blend, blend, blend. The same thing, I do the same thing. If it's, I think I cook too much, I use this. Now we're going to put some highlight and we're going to finish my eyes. And then we're done. We're going to be using the Makeup Revolution. Y'all see that? And I like to go on my finger and... Blend it out. On my nose. To my cuticle. Let's pour a little more highlight here. I usually blend it out with my finger so it won't look so crazy. Okay, you guys, now we're going to go back with the palette and finish our eyes, and we're going to use the burgundy to go under our eyes. Now I'm going to be using this to smudge it out. Using the Nika K Matrix um, Matte Liquid Lipstick. Now we're going to use setting spray. <clears throat> I have to get a good angle so you guys can see my makeup. <laughs> 